I guess the secret sauce behind Wildflower Productions is I'm an event manager by trade. I've been working in, a, in live events for over a decade. And my husband is a graphic designer and a videographer. So when we were in lockdown, we had like a mini production company that we'd already been working on, but that's how we're able to turn out the virtual events. And it's, it's shout out to my husband, Matt, who's been able to do that because it's the lighting, it's all of the, the actual production. We have four cameras for these live streams. What inspired you or how, were you always so fashionable? <laughs> when I started in my 20s, I already thought I missed the boat and I'm now in my 30s and I feel like I'm only just hitting my stride. And the benefit of that is you just feel more confident to be yourself. So the more I'm embracing the kid in me that used to love playing dress ups and just being really extra with glitter and sparkles, and now I do that and everyone's like, anyone should wear a sequin. If you're feeling low, just pop on a sequin. It just, absolutely. It just brings out, this is my day sequin, so. <laughs> my big aha moment. I had probably had a few. And I was literally made redundant from three jobs in a row. And I was like, okay, well maybe I'll just kind of give, you know, DJing as my main shtick a bit of a, a go. And I, I was working within venues and I think a lot of you know, DJs you work up with venue residencies and then little events. And yeah, I never looked back. The Good Vibes Mixes literally started from week one of our first lockdown in March, 2020. And I decided I was going to channel, because I, I had just had a full calendar to an absolutely empty calendar. So I thought, okay, over the next few weeks, I would be able to get a range of mixes that at least somebody would like, you know? So it might be, your uncle might like this one and your sister might like this one and you might like this one. And uh, ended up being, you know, the best part of a year. And I'll continue doing it because I found the feedback has been really lovely. People are enjoying them and looking forward to them. And my side is we're all going through a range of things at different times and if I can just, do something to kind of uplift and provide some good energy, then if it helps one person, then it's worth, worth my time.